What's up ladies and gentlemen, it is Zurai bringing you another Destiny video. Today, uh, I'm continuing on in the Refer a Friend program in Destiny where you link yourself with another Guardian and you finish different objectives with that person. So today, we, well, the previous video we completed a mission together and there are going to be a couple other objectives that we need to do and so I'm not sure what those are right now. But uh, if you give me a second, I'm going to look them up. But uh, it's, it's going to be with my friend McKenjohn. And uh, let's see what's going on. Give me just a second. I'm looking, looking up what objectives we have yet to finish. Okay, so it looks like it looks like we have to complete a patrol and a public event. So it looks like we're going to be going into a patrol on a different on some planet and just doing it together. So nothing nothing complicated at all. So far, these are very simple and uh, and a lot of fun. It actually for me as a new player. Uh, getting invited and kind of being shown the ropes with the more experienced player has helped me kind of figure out what Destiny is about socially um, and what things you can do in the game with other people so I've been playing a lot uh, on my own um, and you know I've learned a lot that way but through this you know I can you know it's Destiny is all about uh, your about social social life too so um, I guess this gets you kind of introduced into it. And of course, there's going to be a sweet loot. And of course, I'm going to have an episode uh, just talking about the loot we get once we finish. And uh, just talking about talking about all that. So I think um, I need to wait for him to set something up. Alright, looks like we're going to the moon here. So, as far as patrols, I think we have to do five, five different patrols, and um, I don't know if they have to be on different planets. But you got the Moon, Mars, Venus, and Earth. Am I missing one? I'm not sure. But uh, that's four, and then we have one public event. So, yeah, let's have some fun. So, thanks for tuning in. Thanks, thank you for watching. If you guys are uh, into anything sci-fi or space related. I'm hoping to have it all here. Careful around the Hellmouth Guardian. Getting some strange for my energy channel. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be having some uh, Halo 5 and Star Wars Battlefront content coming out soon, as soon as I can afford it. And uh, that'll be awesome. Could use a ghost analysis on a few things in this area. Bounty encryption will follow. Come on, little bugger. Okay, so I think, I mean, I need to just follow him. Lagging behind. It looks like we just got a couple little short quests or objectives to finish. Sorry, bud. I need to, um, I actually need to get a, a headset so I can actually talk with McKenjohn as we play. Uh, that would make things so much easier. Let's move. Well. Where is he going? Anomalous energy bursts emanating from this location are of great interest to the Warlock Order. Hurry, Guardian. Gather sensor readings and relay the data to me. Mm, 
So this is nothing complicated, guys. Uh, you just uh, want to go around and finish finish any of these objectives like this. Anything you do in a normal patrol. Except you do it with a friend. That's nothing special. Happy job here. This could be bad. Oh, uh, where am I going? Crap. Good work. I'm sending the upload to the tower now. So there's an optional event over there, and I believe we're supposed to take part in one of these. Like I said, thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, it's been a lot of, a lot of fun getting into this game. I uh, just now, just now playing a lot of Destiny right. take or video games, video games. Period. So. I was a I've been playing a lot of the Crucible lately, and so I'm not. <laughs> you can probably tell if anyone's played much Destiny, but I'm not that great at playing. Um, Guardian down. Really? Where'd you go? Going back. Yeah, that's good. Well done. Way to go, McKendra. And he fell down there somewhere. You okay, buddy? <laughs> okay, what's next, bro? Got a couple more things to do. Ooh, look at his face.
He's actually texting me right now. Okay. He lagged out. I guess our intelligence on this place is getting too stale. Time to shine some light on it, Guardians. Alright, we're supposed to scout out Helmo. Let me know if you guys uh, like these little short clips where I, where I play with some of my friends. Um, I'm enjoying it a lot. Obviously, this isn't any like top-notch quality uh, Destiny videos, but you know it's a lot of fun, and I love playing with the uh, like, people. Right now. <coughs> Excuse me. In the crotch. Shoot him in the crotch. Level up. Congratulations to me. Man, I mean, Ken John's looking so sexy tonight. Just look at him run. I could just sit here and stare for him. <laughs> just kidding. Where am I? Oh, did he lag? Oh, I bet he lagged. Oh, good internet. Oh, good Wi Fi. He's already here. Yo, what's up, brother? We just made Zavala's day. Great work. Come back here. And as always, we're behind McEnjohn. He's so fast. <laughs> Die! Suck on my fat. I promise I'm not gay. I promise. I have a girlfriend. She's not a cover up. I swear. Where to next? We have intel that the enemy is preparing to fortify this location. Hey. You know what to do, Guardians. Coded dispatch follows. Matches your face. Dude, hey. Hey. Hey, buddy. Huh. Enemies killed 0%. Huh. Man, I'm loving that black and white scheme. My, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be coming out with the desk setup, uh, video soon, hopefully. Hopefully, soon. Uh. Um, but, uh, anyways, some of my two favorite colors are black and white, and I like red as well, but red's a little bit used too much in, uh, gaming setups, so I've just been doing black and white, but, as you can tell, I got black and white with a little bit of red in my, my character, uh, but McKenzie, on the other hand, that is sick, wow, why did I have to get stuck? Well, I guess he knows where he's going. Grenade that does nothing. Just making sure my recording software is actually still going. You know, I was trying to record a video um, earlier today where I was finishing up the last mission 
uh, of the original storyline in Destiny. And um, I actually didn't record halfway through. Like the the my PS4 stopped because the PS4 can only record uh, 15 minutes and then it stops. And um, whoops, that was exciting. But uh, anyways, like I was saying, it only records 15 minutes and then you gotta start another clip. And I just forgot to record it. So I put it like, I spent, this probably took me way too long to do, but I spent about 40 minutes on the mission. And, uh, and didn't have a recording. And of course, when you first play something, you know, it's your first reactions, your first hesitant, cautious, or, you know. It's, it's your first impressions of, of, uh, of that mission, and that's what I really wanted to capture. But I didn't. So. Oh well. So if any of you guys are actually liking this video, or uh, just liking um, me playing with with some of my friends on Destiny, let me know, um, so I can be sure to record more, for sure. Um, I really want to know if, if, <clears throat> if these videos actually mean anything to anyone. I know that on the last video that me and McKendron made, it was, uh, we got like 30 views, which for me is actually really good, considering I only have like 14 subscribers. And, uh, so having, having almost... 50% of, of my work. subscriber count on a, on a video is actually really awesome. So please, please uh, share this. Let people know. I, this may not be the most professional or high quality content, but you know I'm, I'm trying to do my best here, and I'm trying to get better. And I want to play some other sci-fi related games. And uh, you know, any encouragement would be much appreciated. I, Weapons continue to intrigue. I wanna I wanna know if people are even interested in me playing games, so and then you cap. Temper claw. I'm gonna head over here. In the face. Also, if you guys have uh, opinions on uh, as far as wife, rifle, 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 ah, weapon, excuse me. Um, as far as a weapon goes, as far as uh, the hunter class, of course, I'm uh, running golden gun right now, which you know is just what you start out with. But uh, I've been playing around with auto rifles, with pulse rifles, um, shotguns, and sniper rifles, and I'm still as, as far as secondaries go. But uh, I don't know what 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 setup I should be running. So if you guys have an opinion, if you play some uh, Destiny, let me know. That way I can uh, see what you guys are running, why I should, why I should do the same. There's a couple of YouTubers I was watching um, who are playing some multiplayer. Okay, towers updated. Some multiplayer uh, stuff, and uh, this guy was talking about a pulse rifle because it still had some a decent amount of damage. Guardians, please. Anything you can scavenge for our ships from the enemy here will go a long way. Alright, how many of these have we finished? Was that like number three that we just did? In the face. Alright, let's uh... 
find some more enemies to kick ass with. If anyone's still watching, I'm so surprised. Like, this would probably bore me to death. Or hey, you can have it playing in the background, you know? Now I just need something to talk about. forced to evac because of heavy tank and resistance. You're my backup plan. Go get him. Oh, sorry. The Kendra was actually trying to go back into orbit, and I messed that up, I guess. The one time I took initiative. How did he get ahead of me? What the heck? Why is the marker saying... Uh, whatever, it's just... How the heck? Should I just wait this one out? Rocket to nothing. Damage. 
I don't know about you guys, but I'm taking the easy way out. Yep, no. Doing nothing. I need to shoot McKenzie on the attack. Saying I can't do this one. I think there's still something else out there. Stay on guard. Well, we'll just uh, sit here and um, sit pretty until Kenjon finishes up. What are we about? Um, we just finished a anime series called uh, Knights of Sidonia. It's a, uh, it's actually on Netflix. It's a Gundam-esque type uh, mecha space age anime, just um, just about uh, the planet Earth uh, being broken up into many different spaceships that are actually built out of the Earth and they fly off in different directions. And the story is just about this one, this one ship called uh, Sidonia, and it, I mean it's massive. The ship itself is massive, and they have what's called guards, which are it's G A R D E, which is the, uh, which is the uh, the name of the next. Um, but it's just about um, just about the their encounters and the enemy the gone, which is kind of a, a high. It's a lot of fun. There's two seasons, long, two seasons long of the manga. Um, the manga is much, much longer. It's about seven years worth of content. Um, the Netflix obviously only had two seasons, so it was kind of a condensed version. There's a lot they didn't cover in the anime. But the anime is very entertaining, very well uh, animated. And I think you guys should check that out. And hopefully, here soon, I'm going to be starting some other sci-fi, space related. I'm not sure what yet. I tried watching some of the old Star Trek um, with uh, William Shatner back in the uh, 60s. But uh, those were kind of. I mean, obviously, I have Might be uh, watching this. Um, I haven't done a podcast in a while. If you guys are watching this, check out my podcast. Um, I did one with uh, my friend Jose from school and uh, one of my best friends, uh, Mark, uh, aka Sanjay. Uh, so check those out. I haven't done those in a while just because they didn't seem really popular. I'm just going to save uh, those for those are actually some of these guys. Just check out this here. I'd be surprised if any of you guys are still watching. Nothing to keep It's not like this is a draft guy. This is just like. It's almost like a strike. This is last one. I almost feel sorry for them. Awesome. Right up until they try to shoot us, that is. Alright, we got the work I'm good if you're gone. Okay, sweet. Oh, it looks like he's a uh, dead orbit dead orbit as far as his faction goes. I'm actually a dead orbit as well. But uh, what else, what else, what else? So yeah, I got a setup video coming. I got uh, the final story missions coming. Um, what other things do I have? Hopefully I can uh, cut, get a podcast together. I got Halo 5 and Star Wars Battlefront, so stay tuned for that. Um, looks like McKendron shot me uh, a text. Oh, we gotta win. Okay, so now we got to win a Crucible match. All right, so let me... Um, let me just cut this short for just a uh, 
just a moment, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Peace out.